In today's video, we're delving into the story of Courtney Clenny, a stunning success with over 2 million Instagram followers, a $3 million income from OnlyFans, and multiple revenue streams. It all began in the vibrant city of Miami, where a relationship balanced on the precipice between passion and destruction. Courtney, a young and captivating woman, carried a haunting past of legal troubles and violent encounters. Despite her challenges, she effortlessly projected an image of charm and allure. In stark contrast, Christian was known for his gentle and caring nature, always striving to bring harmony to their tumultuous bond. As their relationship deepened, those close to them grew increasingly concerned. Reports of altercations, restraining orders, and violence became all too common, leaving friends and family fearing the worst for the young couple. Little did they know that a tragic twist of fate would soon befall them. One fateful evening, an ordinary argument between Courtney and Christian took a horrifying turn. In a fit of rage, Courtney allegedly thrust a knife into Christian's chest, inflicting a grave injury. Instead of immediately calling the police, Courtney inexplicably chose to call her mom first, leaving precious minutes that could have been used to save Christian's life. Realizing the gravity of the situation, Courtney eventually dialed the police herself, spinning the narrative to appear as an act of self-defense. When authorities arrived on the scene, they were met with a horrifying sight, Christian's life hanging by a thread. Rushed to the hospital, his loved ones clung to hope that he would pull through. Tragically, their prayers were in vain and Christian succumbed to the multiple stab wounds, leaving behind a shattered family and community. As the dust settled and investigators delved deeper into the couple's history, disturbing patterns emerged. Courtney's past was riddled with episodes of violence and manipulation, and the veneer of charm she presented was slowly fading away. Doubts arose, questioning whether her claims of self-defense were nothing more than cunning fabrications. The case became a media spectacle shining a harsh spotlight on the stark realities of privilege and the justice system. Courtney's previous encounters with the law and her ability to manipulate the narrative were difficult for many to reconcile with the tragedy that had unfolded. Undeterred by the mounting evidence against her, Courtney's behavior took an even darker turn. Her lack of remorse was evident as she resumed her reckless habits, drowning her sorrows in excessive drinking and frivolous spending. The contrast between her lavish lifestyle and the mourning Christian's family could not have been starker. The trial loomed on the horizon, and the public eagerly awaited justice. Secret recordings began to surface revealing Courtney's abusive behavior towards Christian, including shocking racial slurs, ethical reports, two contradicted her self-defense claims, suggesting that the fatal injuries were not consistent with a thrown knife from a distance. As the courtroom drama unfolded, it was clear that this was not merely a domestic dispute, but a complex web of deceit, abuse, and manipulation. The evidence against Courtney painted a chilling portrait of an aggressive and dangerous individual, making the truth behind Christian's death harder to deny. The loss of Christian, a young man with a promising future, served as a stark reminder of the devastating consequences of domestic violence. His friends and family sought solace in seeking justice for his untimely demise. The trial would be a test of the legal system's ability to hold the perpetrator accountable for their actions. 
As the trial continued, the world watched, hoping for a just outcome. Regardless of the verdict, the tragic tale of Courtney and Christian serves as a haunting reminder of the importance of addressing toxic relationships and seeking help to break the cycle of violence. Their story stands as a testament to the enduring effects of abuse and the urgent need for a society that supports victims while holding aggressors accountable. Only time will tell if justice will be served, bringing closure to a heart-wrenching chapter in the lives of all involved. That is all for today. Thanks for watching.